For some teenagers, summer means a vacation from learning. For others, it means building robots, analyzing DNA, and policing water pollution. The UW Tacoma Institute of Technology has the Math Science Leadership Program, which hosts diverse youth entering 7th through 12th grade. And then do you understand um, why we use the one and the negative one? Because that, that part can be kind of confusing sometimes. We bring students onto campus for pretty intense three-week project-based learning to get them to do different types of science and engineering projects. Now these are always pushed in. Right? The plan is to encourage students who might not otherwise consider science and engineering careers. You won't wait for light to be right here. Yeah, that will work. Good. It's a dynamic mix of work and play. Our goal for a robot is um, for this to find the green dot. It's like a blackboard with different colored dots. And we have to use this program and find color values using the light continuum, whereas like all the colors are different numbers. Campers do cool projects, make friends, and build leadership skills that they can use throughout their lives, whether or not they choose to go into science. Three, two, one, go. So this is the blood sample that I got off of knife one, and so I'm gonna test it to see what kind of blood it is. 10th graders are actually learning how to use forensic science, and they're using that knowledge to make their own episode of CSI. No clotting, again, that means it's probably type Q blood. We've basically been filming every single step of the way from gathering the evidence to labeling suspects, identifying the crime, and as you can see right now, we're just kind of solving who is who. And it seems like he's hovering over the water. The ninth grade students in our program are building video games with the Microsoft software Kodu that was specifically designed so that students could learn programming skills. Well, the stars are worth 100 points and the hearts are worth five. And then these fish enemies, they can kill you. And if you don't pay attention, you'll fall off the edge. Many students return to camp every summer and look forward to the next adventure. Every year we do something different, and so this year we are doing water sampling, and we've water sampling at the Puyallup River, Commencement Bay, and Thea Falls. I remember when we're going to put that in, we need to rinse it, yeah. because we want to eliminate transfer of water that was inside of that before we collect our samples. So you guys going to set it? Awesome. It's just amazing about what kind of things we found in the water and what kind of things are actually going into the water. The Math Science Leadership Program really targets students who are underrepresented in the sciences. And part of that is because we know that we're not producing enough scientists and engineers in the U.S. I've been in the program for six years, ever since the sixth grade, and I loved it. It's like super amazing. I've, I've learned so, so many different new things about science and math, and this made me want to go into a science like career. Well, our first hypothesis was that we thought that the FOSS would have the most um, compounds in there. And we need more scientists and a greater diversity of the kinds of people who are becoming scientists to not only meet the economic needs, but to meet some of the really large global challenges that we're facing. All of my heart is working. My favorite part of the program is seeing kids grow seeing them get excited and when we high five and say, I love science. Yay, I feel so good now.